Hey, this is YBR with BeamNG Drive, and today we're gonna hurt some dummies. And I don't mean I'm gonna hurt myself. Well, maybe I could, you never know with me. I might be playing right here on this game, and then I just fall out my couch, you hear a bang, and you're like, what in the world was that? And it's like, YBR fell out of his couch, yep, another dummy was hurt. But the dummy we, we plan to hurt is this dummy. The one doing that, almost trying to do like a Michael Jackson lean. Right there, you see that? And uh, for him, well, we're going to take a lot of you guys' ideas and do what you guys wanted to see. And I think the most requested thing was steamrolling the dummy. So, yep, that is what we're going to do. Uh, if we can control this thing, if you remember correctly, this thing is a pain to control going backwards and forwards because it doesn't have any brakes. And look at that, they're actually the same orange. That's kind of weird, isn't it? It's like they're both the same kind of orange. I don't know, it's just weird, you know? I never noticed that. Like, it's so similar in shade. So there we go, crunch. Crunching, and he's he's inside of the wheel. I don't think that would happen in real life normally. I think uh, normally in real life he wouldn't go inside of the wheel. So yeah, that 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 kills the dummy. Let's try it again. Maybe we need to go a little bit faster. Uh, you know what? This thing moves so slow. You know what? Instead of doing that, let's just go like this. Whee! Boom! So much faster. Alright, so we're going to try to hit the dummy a little bit faster, see if that makes it a little less uh, glitchy. We'll also try slow-mo, because why not? We get to see him break his skull, maybe, you know? Because if you get hit by a steamroller at just 20 miles per hour, that is just, that's going to hurt a ton. Like right there, that's probably broke his neck. Just the impact, the way it hit right on his neck, it's probably a broken neck. And now he just gets om nom nommed and he's stuck again. What are you doing getting eaten by the wheel? You know, the neat thing is, he's totally gone now. Like... Sure, he's sort of in the wheel, but it's just like he's so barely there, we don't even really have to care about him. Which gives me an idea. I tried to flip it over to see if it would get him out, but it didn't. How many dummies can we fit in a steamroller wheel? Can we, like, run over, like, a dozen of them? Just like, crunch, 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 crunch. So, let's, uh, let's try about five of them or so and see what happens. We're just going to run over, like, five dummies just crunching them. Oh, no. Stand up. Alright, making sure they're... Okay. Stand up, dummy. 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 Hey, what are you doing? Stand up. Alright, here we go. So first, we'll take out those four over there. And then we'll come back for those two or three, was it? Two. So that's six in total, actually. I don't know where the, f the extra one came. I was like, my plan was five. I guess I was just too excited and hit the spawn more cars button too hard, too fast. Alright, so we're just gonna eat the dummies with the steamroller. Be like, nom 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 nom. Nom 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 nom. Steamroller hungers. Oh, look. One of them made it through. Two of them made it through. There we go. See? When you have multiple ones, some of them will make it through. And the other two are just kind of stuck on the underside. So I flip it over. You can kind of see that they actually didn't get stuck in the wheel at all that time. Ironic as that. I have the whole thing planned out for them to get stuck under it, then they don't do it. Why you do this, buddy? Why? Why? It's like, you ruined my plans, dummy. You ruined them. You're fired. Speaking of fired, you actually will be fired really soon because we're gonna shove you into a cannon soon. That'll probably be the next thing we do because I don't think I ever, I don't think I ever did that, but we will try this again. Om nom nom, om nom nom, om nom nom. There we go. The speed was better there. Look at that. Uh oh. Is that fr the front wheel is still spinning? It's all good. It is slowing down though. Those dummies are giving all kind of. Look at it. The dummies are smoking. And those dummies are on fire. <laughs> it's just the friction. Like, they're just scraping their faces off in the steamroll. I'm just like, la 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 la, I gotta steamroll these guys. This is the most brutal, violent thing ever, and I'm just like, la 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 la, uh oh. Look at that, we just have a pile. Oh, 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 we broke the game. Uh, we broke it. We broke it. We broke it. The steamroller actually was the thing that glitched out, not the dummies. You can tell because the steamroller is the one that's missing parts, at least that's what I've been told. If um, the, the parts that are missing are the parts that glitch out, is what I've been told. So it was the steamroller's wheels that broke. Okay, so, now, as I was saying, the dummies are now going to be fired. Not by the crusher. You can't crush with a... You can't do that. There we go. Cannon. Yes. Let's go ahead and raise this thing. If you don't know how to use a cannon, use the blinker buttons to raise and lower it, and then the parking brake to shoot it. And you can use the buttons right here on your screen. That's the easy way to do it. And uh, let's move some dummies into there. We'll start off with just one, and then we'll throw, like, all six of them in there and see what happens. So let's go in here, dummy. Get in there. Come on, uh, we gotta put him a little deeper. He's not falling in, you know. Get in there. There we go. All right, let's shoot a dummy. Okay, here we go. Shoot that dummy. No. 
Not bad, not bad. All right, so one definitely works. So the question is, can you do it like a um, like a uh, a multiple dummy attack where you have like four of them at once or six of them at once? Actually, is because how many I have, or will they kind of stick together? That's a question we shall answer once we stack them all in here. That's it. Four out of six, so two more. Drop the dummy in. Next. Next. I think that's all of them. All right, we're going to try shooting all these dummies out of here. Put a little bit of slow-mo on this, because why not? Do you hear all that air noise? It's like a loud. It's just a ball of dummies. Oh, that's weird. It's just like a ball of them. All right, what if, what if you speed it up? Whoop, a little bit of a lag there. So it becomes a ball of dummies. That is weird. Can we take out a helicopter with a ball of dummies? That's a, uh oh. We're gonna squish a ball of dummies because I ru I did that wrong. Cannons not reset. Sorry, dummies. All right, there we go. Sorry about that. All right, so let's try um, let's try taking out a helicopter with a ball of dummies. We're gonna use the only helicopter that functions in this version of BMG Drive, the experimental one, which is the Bell 407, and we're just gonna shoot them dummies at it and see what happens. So where is the Bell? Bell, Bell, Bell 407. And we gotta line this thing up right about there. Perfect. All right, and manual without clutch, without automatic clutch, I should say. And we can slowly raise it. Freeze physics, how's the helicopter doing? Alright, uh, maybe we need to raise it a little faster. Hey, helicopter, I'm not even telling you to fly in any direction in specific. You're just going all on your own, gonna go like that way, huh? Just go straight up. Alright, perfect. Cannon, are you ready? We're gonna shoot that thing, alright? Dummy bomb away! Oh no, helicopter, you're too high. Oh, you little pest. Oh, I am I am so mad at you right now, helicopter. Why you do that? All right, try it again. Dummy bomb, reload the dummy bomb, reload it. Don't accidentally put YBR in there. Right, so this, it comes out at the bottom. I didn't think about that. I was thinking it would come out in the middle. So that's why I missed on that one. So this time we'll take note of that and Plan it pro um, appropriately, so shoot it now. Dummy bomb away! Roar. Oh, it didn't do anything. It just kind of went right through it. Oh, it grabbed him. It grabbed the helicopter. This is like a bunch. Oh, this is it's like um, it's like those zombie movies or whatever where you just have a bunch of like zombies just hanging on your helicopter like ah. So it looks like just a bunch of dummies like ah. I was going to take your helicopter down. And without me controlling the helicopter, it did get taken down by the dummies. Just all the weight in the front pulled it straight down. Oh, that was great. I wonder if it'll still fly with all the dummies attached if we have enough speed. Nah. I think it might be something that's caught in the blades or something because we can't... Oh, uh, wait, wait, wait. Yeah, we can't get it to spin real fast anymore. Oh, well. See, it doesn't spin fast. Weird. Oh well, who knows. Uh, anyways, that's uh, the dummy cannon doing the dummy bomb. And you see, they just kind of all stick together. They're a good group of friends or something, I guess, huh? Oh jeez, I just accidentally shot him. That was a... whoops. Alright, let's see here. I have one other idea, actually, I want to try for this. I think there might be a way we could do the dummy bomb, or do the dummies without it being a bomb. Of them, like it's actual more shotgunny, you know, if you know what I mean. I think if we reset it and then free, well, I'll show you what I'm doing. So first, we got to put them all back in the cannon again, and we're gonna have to put them in slightly separate places. That's gonna be the difficult part. But if we do that, this might this might be different. I don't know. We're gonna figure it out. I don't know, man. It's a good possibility it won't work. I'll tell you that now. There's also a good. There is also a, a small possibility it will. I can't tell which are dummies and which are the helicopter. I guess anything on the interior is a dummy, right? That's what I'm going to hope. So that has to be a dummy, right? Okay, so we're going to freeze physics. 
Reset the dummies so they're all standing. Like that, right? There you go. And then we're going to shoot the cannon, which is the cannon. There we go. Like there, and just unfreeze physics at the same time and see what happens. Do we get a dummy bomb or a. Oh, look at that. That one worked a little bit better, except two of them just got beheaded. Three of them got beheaded. Actually, there's three legs there. So, I think dummy bomb works the best. Just a blob of them. The blob bomb thing. I don't know what to call it, man. It's not like it explodes or anything. But just the fact that it's a collection of them makes me want to call it a bomb, you know? I don't know why. Um, so, yeah, that's uh, shooting them out the cannon. Let's do something else with these dummies. So, uh, how about instead of a cannon, we use the... Uh, Ooh, I know there's a crusher in here, isn't there? I don't know, they might be too small for this, but we'll try it anyways. We are going to crush these dummies, all of them. Yes, all of them. Shove them in there. One dummy. Two dummies. You know, they're already beat up from the cannon. It's like, well, now we're going to crush them. Somebody should have a count of how many dummies died in the video, you know? That'd be amazing if somebody could actually, you know, count all... How many dummies did YPR kill? Oh, that's a lot of dummies crazy. Alright. Crush it real good. Whoops. Wrong direction. There we go. Let's see what happens. It might glitch up right here, I'm thinking, if it gets too crushed. Or it might not crush it enough and nothing will happen. Doesn't crush it enough. Just makes a little glob. A little blob of them. Oh, look. They get along so well. So that didn't work out at all. Oh, well. What else can we do? Um... Let's see, one of the things I know people wanted to see was H-cubing dummies. Which I did a little bit of in um, the bowling video, but we could do a little bit more here, why not? We could do it like this even, we could line them up in a row. So we got like one dummy. And then two dummies. And three dummies. Just all the dummies. Whoops, I lost my mark, there we go. Three dummies. Four dummies. Let's count the dummies. Five. Oh my goodness, look at his face. Oh, my. I can't zoom in real good because I tap it too hard. There we oh, there. Oh, well. You can see it, right? That face is like, wow. Scary looking, man. Horror movie up in here. Alright. And six dummies in a row. Wait, what? How'd you? What did you do? I said over here, boy. What you? Maybe that's another one. Maybe it was only five. I don't know. I know I reset on where he fell. That's okay. That's part of the plan. All right, where's the HQ? Here we go. Oh, we gotta move it over a bit. Perfect. This is the eight thousand kilogram one. I don't know if it has slow mo, but I want to make sure it does. So now I know it does. We gotta reset it one more time. Two more times. Oh goodness! Get out of that dummy. Sounds weird. Get out of the dummy. Alright, we'll just do it from here. Go! Well, we missed some of them. That's okay. They kind of pushed the H-cube off the track when they hit. See, the problem is it just keeps going like a little too much or a little too li little. Like, watch. Oh, there we go. There we go. Okay. Let's try to do slow-mo then. Slow-mo, engage! One dummy! We're going to try to hit them all this time. Two dummies! Three dummies! Four dummies, just barely! Five dummies! Six dummies! We hit all of them. And that's what happens when you hit them with the HQ. Ooh! I, I, I mentioned this in the bowling video, but look. Then you have this, like, dummy gun where you just shoot them like that. Do you see that? They just... Oh, goodness! Well, it kind of works until they break physics. Oh, sheesh! Did you see that guy? He's like, I I'm, I'm done with you. I'm just gonna explode right here real quick. That was violent, man. Okay. So let's see. Let me look let me look at my let me look at my list of things I needed to do real quick and I'll be right back. Alright, sorry about that. I just I knew I had a bunch more things I wanted to do, but I couldn't remember what they were. So I had them written down, so I just said, let me look at my list. Look at my list. I'm like, ooh, I wanted to do that and that and that. And so yeah, now we can do the things I wanted to do as well as you know you guys want to do it, because a lot of them are your guys' suggestions. And the first thing we're going to do is get the T-Series. Because we need a truck. A big truck. Like a giant truck. A truck, truck. Just a oh, truck, you know? Like this. Yes. Oh, goodness. It's already squishing him. Calm down, T-Series. Not yet. Not yet. 
so vicious, man. It's already like, I'm going to kill them. Calm down. All right, make sure they're all okay. Okay, now we can kill them. We'll do it from the inside and the exterior. So you're like, la 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 la. Oops, oops, oops. Look at that. The truck barely slows down, it looks like, from the inside. Where'd the dummies go? It looks like uh, most of them, did, like, most of them get drug along. Look at that. <laughs> Look at that. It's just a pile of dummies below the truck getting drug along. Yeah, I didn't realize they were there, officer, honestly. Oh, that's crazy. He's got a helicopter just sitting there, too. All right, let's do it where we can see him ha actually get hit this time. Whoa. I accelerated too early. The big rig was all damaged and the wheels was churning all on its own, it looked like. Big rig spawns high in the air, it seems like, you know? All right, so here we go from the outside. A little bit of slow-mo on it. Just a little bit, not a hundred times. Boom. Just falls forward, then his friend, too. Boom! And his other friend, too. Whoa, we're getting pulled off course! Churn! It's okay. We got him. Keep churning, though. We gotta churn. We wanna hit them all. Oh, don't tip over, though. We're good. It's all good. Boom! Perfect hit. This is only 20 miles per hour. It's pretty slow, honestly. But, you know, in real time, it's, you know, it's pretty fast. Oh, I missed now. See what happened when I hit real time. I thought that was the last one. I forgot there was six, not five. We just spat one out. Do you see it? It looked like it just spat it out from out under it. Run, run over, run over, over, run him over. Yes. I, I like how they just disappear up under the car like that one right there. Like that guy right here. He's just like, you don't, you don't see him really. It's like, wait, what's that? Is that a, oh my God, it's a body, <laughs> you know? All right, the other thing, next thing we're going to try is um, putting the dummies into a vehicle. And not the way that you would actually, like, you were actually driving it, because that doesn't really work no matter what. We, I mean, like this, where we have a cargo box run, and we shove them in the back and see what it looks like. So, one dummy. Oh, the box van's moving around. Stop it. Is it in? I can't tell. Oh, kind of. It's thinking van. Stop moving around. Oh, goodness, that is, we just hung a man. All right, maybe what we need to do is make him, uh... Yeah, I know what we could do. We'll run them over first, and then that way they won't be standing upright, because that's part of the problem, is they're standing upright. That's funny. These people are standing. Hmm, how do I make them sit down? Let me run them over. Sure, I could try asking them politely, but yeah, nah, let's just run them over. There we go. Now we can put them in the box van. One dummy. Uh, maybe I'll use the map editor if it's getting to be this troublesome. It seems to be a little trouble more so troublesome than I thought. I don't know. I figured it would be pretty easy, and it's like it keeps mess I keep messing it up. There we go. That's okay. I guess we don't need the map editor. It works. It's working all right. Now the problem is these doors are not like locked shut or anything. They will open up the second the dummies probably press on them too hard. So um, well yeah, I don't know what will, ha what will happen with them. We just got a pile of dummies though. We are now YBR's crash testing transporting service. We are transporting our crash test dummies and we'll see what happens. Mmm, there. Perfect. Let's try driving them. You know, if those things weighed like, I think they weighed like almost 200 pounds, didn't they? You know, for like the average American weight? That means that's almost like a whole half ton of dummies back there. Well, actually, it might be more than it. I don't know. Depends how close it was to 200. So as they're driving around, we're just going to see if they fall out. And if they don't fall out, oh, look, he's sticking his head out. He's like, hey, what's going on out there? He's like, what's going on out there? I know something's up. And we busted the truck already? Dang, that's unfortunate. Like, the, the it's busted, dude. You ain't getting nowhere with this thing now. All right, how about this? Let's see. Reset all the dummies. I know it's just going to make a pile of them. That's fine. There, I got them all reset, right? Bring the truck back to the start. Oh, don't run them over. Bad truck. No. No, don't run over the products. Worst company ever. Oh, did I miss this one? Now, what I was going to do is I was going to try to do this here. Let's see if it works. We're going to use the map editor for it. So we're hitting F11. Then we're going to go up here and we're going to use this selection thingy. And we're going to just try this. Select them all. And just whoop, <laughs> whoop, they're in. That works. Actually, that worked. Look, they're in. 
That actually worked! I can't believe that worked. Awesome. And we can do that at first anyways. It's not like the first time was a waste because they were so far away initially. Alright, so what's it look like actually inside there, huh? As we're driving along, let's try to see what it looks like. Mm. There we go. Oh, a little less. I, don't see, I can't see where I'm going, by the way. We're just going to see what the dummies do. They're actually pretty stable. Look at that. They're like, they barely move around. I'm trying to like, you know, I'm going 40 miles per hour and churning as hard as I can. They're just like, oh, it's okay. Look at them. See, don't get cocky, man. I'll roll this thing. Yeah, now what? You're going to have to move. Oh, his foot's in the... Oh, well. So they're not perfectly in there after all, it turns out. Whoopsie. Oh, but you can put them in there and they actually don't seem like they want to fall out. They seem like they stay pretty well. You know, even ignoring the fact that that one's glitched in, the rest of them weren't. So that's not bad. I could open a transportation service, I'm pretty sure. Alright, what else could we do? Um, ooh, 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 I got an idea. Oh, don't, you're not the right one, you. You will be a car crusher now. Lord crusher, I should say. Oh, wait, no, 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 roller, 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 I already tried the crusher. I, I know what I want, I just gotta remember the name. Large roller, there we go. Ta-da! Then we're gonna get some dummies. Oh my goodness, that is... That is wrong. That is just wrong. Put them right here, just up, oh, oh, not like that. Put them right there. Turn the roller up. Come on, oh, there we go. And we're gonna have to put him into the roller, so... Carefully! Yeah, carefully just involves dropping him on his face. Oh, come on, get in there. He's like touching it, like, ooh, look, a roller. Touch, 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 touch. You know, they look like they're going the wrong way, but it's all an illusion, man. Look, see? They're going the right way, but it looks like they don't. Don't. I mean, it looks like it's not, you know? It's all an illusion, though. Doing. Oh, that's it? It didn't do nothing to him. He just, like, bounces around. The hard part's actually getting him in. You know, because we, they, he doesn't have any way to move on his own. Oh, look at his legs. They just got shredded. Like, oh, 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 oh. He just shreds his legs up. Oh, my goodness. His knee, like, broke. It looked like his knee disappeared or something for a second. It's still there after all, but... So, yeah, that... That is interesting. You know, nothing really happens to him. He just kind of flies out of it. Like, oh, blah. What if we put, like, ten of them in at once? Using the same strategy as before. Truck, what are you doing? You need to move. I think this one's a truck, is it? Nope. That one's a truck. Ah, oh, okay. Truck out of the way. Raw. Dummy, into the pile. Is that all the dummies? Ah, oh, this dummy's not in the pile. Get to the dummy pile. Are you trying to be smart and avoid the pile? You can't avoid the pile. And now we use the map editor. And we're gonna go ahead and just drag them in. So we go, whoop, blah, got those dummies. What? Weird, the dragging arrow's way... Oh, whatever. So, oh, oh goodness, I selected something I didn't need to want to select. <laughs> I'm selecting the ground. I'm still selecting the ground. No, I'm selecting every, I'm selecting all kinds of stuff I don't want. How about like that? Is that better? There we go. Alright, so freeze physics so we can move them around. Oh, we missed one. What? How do you do this, dummy? I'll get you this time. Oh, we selected like the sun or something now. Shades. There. You can tell that's the right selection. Probably. Perfect. Alright, we can just shove these guys into it and unfreeze physics once they're there and see what happens. Just a bunch of dummies looking at a roller. And, well, they shouldn't be looking at the roller this close. That's all I have to say. Okay. Unfreeze physics! That's it? Ah, still boring. Even with a pile of them, it's like, yeah, that's okay, well, whatever. And, um, let's see here. There's a couple more things I could think of. Oh, look at him just rubbing his face all over. Ooh, that looked bad. Broke his back. Uh, there is one more thing I wanted to do. And I need to, um, let me see. Uh, well, actually, I'm trying to think. Is there anything else I want to do at this map? Oh, 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 I forgot. I thought one more thing. We should, uh... Try crushing him with the wind and stuff, you know, so he could be like, Lots of wind! Whoa! He fell over! So that's what happens when you're in a tornado in real life, like an F5 or something. EF5, whatever you want to call it. That one's a lot of wind. 
<laughs> um, how about less wind? Maybe only like, you know, just a little bit of wind going up. So you like, until he flies. Like 40? 50? 60? I guess he, he's he's pretty sturdy standing up. 80? Are you serious? 100? There we go. He's getting abducted by aliens! The aliens are here! Guys! Everybody else is just laying down in a pile all like, I'm dead. Oh, well, yeah, huh, they're dead. I, I forgot about that. Well, that's not supposed to be 19, it's supposed to be 90. I messed that up. There you go. Now he's just kind of like a, a, a weightless thing. Watch what happens when we hit him. Oh, jeez. So when we hit him, he's just going to kind of fly along, hopefully. Boop. Ah, look at that! <laughs> it just looked hilarious. He just started to fly away. We just bump him, but he's like, I'm out of here. <laughs> he just flies away. I'm Superman. You can't tell me what to do. I'm flying away. He really did look like Superman when you hit him, though. He's just like, I'm out of here. Just flying away and stuff. That was, that was, that was great. He's just, oh my goodness. I never expected him to fly. I figured he would just kind of float along, but instead he's like, Superman and out of there and stuff. What? I mean, what was that? It's just like the lightest hit, too. It's just like, here's a little bump and Superman and watch. Oh, come on, move. How annoying. There we go. I had to use a different uh, transmission. So we're just gonna go. Oh my god, are you okay? He's like walking, he's staggering. He's like, I'm okay. Whoa, 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 whoa. Uh, the guy in the truck is just like, what just happened? You know, he bumped a man and then he just flew away. He's just like, he's, he's out of here. And they're always in the truck all of a sudden. Yeah, unfortunately they don't work in vehicles still. Uh, the reason actually is I think the seats aren't made to really crash. So they're not made as an, a solid object, you know? Um, you can also try the opposite, you know? Negative winds. Oh, it's so heavy. Oh. oh, it's really heavy. Oh, it's really heavy. Oh, oh that was too heavy. Alright, let's not do that. The winds are too heavy. Alright, um, so let's go ahead and uh, do the last thing I wanted to do, which is, uh, no, we don't want to save it. I ruined it when I clicked things anyways. We're going to go to Brutal Slope, and we're going to just let him slide down that, because you guys wanted to see that, and we'll do a leap of death and throw him off of that. Okay, so here we are. Let's, uh, let's just go over here and drop a dummy. It's going to be like, right about there. So we go reset as the vehicle. Oops, hit the wrong button. We reset as the vehicle, and then we're going to say, stop. You are now a dummy. You are no longer a vehicle. You're a dummy. So imagine this is like a giant water slide of death. So you're like, wee, I'm going down my water slide. And then before you know it, you're like, how long is this water slide? Oh, this, this, this is dirt. This isn't water. This burns. You know, you're just getting grass burns. It's, no, it's not pleasant at all. It's not good, man. It's not good. And all of a sudden, you're going highway speeds, just sliding along. So that's, that's really not good. And we're gonna s oh no don't hit the, the don't hit the tube oh ooh now he's scraping his face on the tube and he's not going as fast as a car uh, as you would think you know as you'd expect you know he's uh, going much slower and he's gonna miss well let's do the full water slide effect then how about that so so he missed the ramp a little bit but you know what this is a water slide I said right let's make it as water slidey as possible Whee! oh no where's the pool. Where's the pool? And blah. Smacked his head even. That's death. <laughs> Somebody drained the pool and nobody told him. Oh, shoot. I forgot to, um... Because I did that, now we're at the very bottom and I don't know a way to easily get up to the top fast. Um... Uh, yeah, be right back. And here we are back at the top with the convenience of speed get there real fast and now we're gonna go down it again This time we're just gonna say we water slide and then uh, wait a minute. This isn't a water slide and splat That is the plan at least and you know I almost wanted I almost should just edit out half of the slide because the slide's slow It's like we I'm slamming my face into this dirt. That's painful But we anyways I'm just hoping it uh Watch well, it's gonna make it to the ramp legitimately this time. I was like really? You make it to the ramp now? You couldn't have made it the first time? No, no, you're gonna make it now just to annoy me? 
I swear that's what it looks like. It looks like it's on path to go that ramp. Oh, you jo you're joking, right? No way. Yep, it is. It is. It is totally on path for the ramp. Maybe even too much. I don't know. Uh, either way, though, we don't want to hit the ramp. That's not what we were aiming for. So, let's just freeze physics and be like, Wee, we're over here now. There we go. And, bunk. Oh, it's just a concussion. You'll be fine. Right, let's look at his head. Does it, has it, is it, yeah, oh, that's fine. It's just a broken arm. Or is that his arm or his head? That's his, oh, there's his head. No, oh, that's, that's a little more than a concussion, isn't it? Uh, if you could see it good enough, that is, yeah, his head kind of exploded. Okay, let's go somewhere else then. Let's go to Leap of Death. Do that a couple of times, then we done with the dummy testing some more, unless there's more you guys want to see, in which case, feel free to request it and we can do it. Okay, now we have the fun uh, question of how do we get this to go down, you know? There's a lot of ways you could have like a little scenario and everything, you know? You could have a guy who's like, oh, look at the, the beautiful view, and then a car slams into him. Or you could have a depressed man who's just like, I can't do this anymore. There's a, a bunch of ways you could do it. And, I, I, and there's a guy who's like, oh, look at the pretty view like that, too, because, I don't know, why would you ever do that? That seems risky. Oh, look at the pretty view. Oh, my goodness, I'm falling, I'm falling. Oh, well, yep, and then he falls. He's just... Oh, he's actually going to reach 100 miles per hour? Yep, he got 100 just for a second. It's not bad. I think your foot's pointed the wrong way, just a little bit. Just just a little bit. I, I don't know if you noticed. It's kind of the wrong way. There you go. Wait, are both of your feet pointed backwards now? No, no, not that. That other foot was the one that was pointed backwards. Not that one. Oh, shoot. You ruined your feet, man. You need to get new ankles. Look at his butt, too. He broke his butt. Never seen him, I've never seen a person break his butt before, but he just did. So not much actual things happen besides, oh my goodness, limb X is all crazy, you know? That's pretty much what it is. It's like, his butt's crazy, his foot's crazy, his knee's crazy, his arm's crazy. Because everything's crazy at that situation. He looks like he was hugging himself. Um, like a straight jacket kind of hug, you know? Oh, look at that gymnastic ability. Did you see that? Ooh. So talented. Alright, let's make sure it's a different angle. She's like, hey, look, I can go up higher than you guys. Look, I'm way up here. Oh, no. Ah. Uh, oh, that's not the right direction to fall. Oh, that's worse. Get up there. Uh. Wee. Oh, wait, wait. Ah, uh, let's just drop him. Let's just stop playing around. Just drop him. He looks relaxed. He's like, hmm. Look all relaxed and stuff as he's falling. It's funny just watching the limbs though. His limbs just go all over the place like... <laughs> and now his limbs are a little... Oh, look at that. Look at that flexibility right there. Do you see that flexibility? Look at this. How you do that? I want to learn how to do that. Without breaking any bones at least. You know, I'm, I'm pretty sure I could do that. I would just break a, a, a couple dozen bones in the process. Yes, a couple dozen, because I'd probably find a way to break my ribs in the process. Which is, no. Don't ask me how, but I'd find a way. So, yeah, that is just doing some more of the dummy, though. Like I said, and if there's anything else you guys want to see, feel free to request it, and we can do some more of it. Uh, anyway, otherwise, until next time, this is Bill YBR just glitching this thing out. I'll see you.